good morning my dear read the problem twice or thrice many times and giving this instruction you have to improve that habit of reading the problem twice or thrice find the least number by which 1800 should be multiplied so that it becomes a perfect square also find the square root of the perfect square thus obtain so you have to find the least number by which 1800 should be multiplied so that it becomes a perfect square understand also find the square root of the perfect square number after multiplying you will get the perfect square number for that number you got to find out the square root understand so how you got to find out is 1800 actually easy way is here there are two zeros two zeros means automatically what will you get very good 10 into 10 if you are removing this two zeros 10 into 10 so you can take only 18 alone this is one way of doing so 2 understand 9 twos are 18 next is what 3 threes are 9 so 1800 should be multiplied by 2 because 2 does not have a pair 8 10 also it has a pair 3 also it has a pair 2 only it does not have a pair so 1800 should be multiplied by 2 this is one way of doing understand so multiplied by 2 means what this is 1800 into 2 understand into 2 that is 3600 3600 so mentally you can do that is what 60 but suppose if you want to go in 1800 into 2 that is 20 82 16 remainder 1 1 2 is to 3600 so for this finding out the square root for out of these two zeros one zero for 36 what 60 so 60 will be the square root of 3600 so immediately you can say the answer within a minute suppose for better understanding for the late bloomers purpose wow you have to do is 1800 Since it is ending with the zero, what can you take? Ten you can take. No need to take the prime numbers alone. Understand? No need to take the prime numbers alone. Since it is ending with zero, ten I am taking. That means what? Ten means very good. One hundred and eighty. One hundred and eighty. Next one is what? Ten. Next is what? Eighteen. Next. Which one? Three table also you can take. Five threes are fifteen. Six threes are eighteen. Again three. Two threes are six. Why I have chosen three here is because in order to get in pairs, two also you can take. Eighteen means one plus eight is nine. It comes in three table. So I have chosen three. Puri da di ganne. The pair pair ka da kinon. इंगे प्राइम नंबर था ये डिग्री नोट रहता लाग करेगा। आई मेरे थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड टेन नोट ने ना वो रों वन टेन नीस टेन रिमाइंडर ये ये टी ये टेन सार ये टी पुरी दिन ला ये टेन सार ये टी इन द जीरो अपनी इंगे बंदो अरे मर दे इंगे वन टेन नीस टेन ये टेन सार ये टी पुरी दर इगने इन द जीरो This two does not have a pair, so thousand eight hundred should be multiplied multiplied by two. Puridhula, yeh kya hai? To get perfect square, to get the perfect square. This is not a perfect square number. Understand? Because two does not have a pair. So thousand eight hundred into two equal to three thousand six hundred. Understand? 
for this if you are able to do it directly you can do it otherwise as usual you can go understand that is 3610 what is it 360 again 10 next one is 36 66 or 36 so what is it root of 3600 equal to root of 10 into 10 into 6 into 6 Out of these two, ten, one ten you have taken. Out of these two six, one six you are taking. So sixty. Those who are unable to write it directly, you can go for this method. Otherwise, those who know, you can write it. Understand? Only they have asked for multiplied. They didn't ask for division. So only multiplication I did it. Do you follow, everyone of you? Thank you.